On the top of a hill that is so tall that I can imagine it tangling with sunken constellations, I'm watching this beautiful woman dancing in front of me like a calm pond, soft song fire, abandoning her vanity and burning brighter and brighter at the point where light beams bend into new colors in a hidden crystal prism of the atmosphere where every crest of wet dew that she kicks up between us catches the splendid, blended minuet of moonlight bending with her body's every movement, her dances every step. She is radiating light with her eyes closed. She's swelling with celebration, electric with joy as she dances, still dancing as she says that this is how she worships. It might feel right if I try it. Then I hesitate and say that I've been distracted, throwing the pages of my stacked days back so fast that some nights I swear that I can feel one perfectly exact perfect half of creation collapse in on the other with every other heartbeat and there's this little angel of nothing singing to me through these silent vibrant colors she's telling me that I shouldn't worry so much about this shaking in my fingertips that gets me standing at a steady standstill standing at a steady distance from this depth with the sky peeling upward like a helpless burning painting above us crumbling into its hundreds of masterpieces around her rapture her release stops dancing, pulls me in and says, Sugar, just between you and me, what if we pretend that heaven is wherever we might be, and that God is just another word for everyone and everything? You know, it's not so complicated when we love it simply worshiping the blessing of each breath with the next. We all have galaxies to be grateful for, even if they don't always make that much sense. So now that I'm really feeling it, I'm gonna grind my teeth into a new grin. I'm gonna smile at this beauty as I twist it into me and start dancing with her naturally. The growing friction of my soul starts unfolding open like some bursting, blossoming, beautiful bulb as though the restless have all finally found sleep because of what we are doing tonight. The blind have finally begun to stumble into the covers of each other's dreams. This is life. Thanks for life, giving thanks for life. These currents that seem to have traveled through everything else in the universe before finally finding their way to this hillside are charged here between us with even more wonderful wonder and more color light.